In today's video, we're going to answer the question, how do you redirect traffic from an old WordPress page or post to a new one? Are you ready? Let's go. There are a couple of reasons why you would want to create a 301 redirect. The first one is you are creating a brand new page to replace an old one. The second reason would be if you are changing the permalink of your current page. In today's example, we are gonna redirect this sample page to my demo about page. I'm gonna show you how to easily redirect your WordPress pages and posts using a plugin called Redirection. To get started, let's head over to our dashboard. And we are gonna use a plugin. So we'll, on the left-hand side, we'll click on plugins. And at the very top, we'll click on add new. And over on the right-hand side, we can type in redirection and the plugin will come up. It looks like this with some little flowers. It has over 1 million active installations. Go ahead and click on install now. Once that's installed, you can click on activate. In order to begin using redirection, it's really very simple. Go ahead and click on settings right there under the word redirection. If this is the first time using redirection on your WordPress website, you'll come to this welcome page. If you scroll down to the bottom, go ahead and click start setup. There are some basic options you can enable at the beginning of the setup if you want to monitor permalink changes in WordPress pages and posts, and if you'd like to keep a log of all redirects and 404 errors. There are links to read more about this if you have any additional questions on what that means. For now, we're gonna go ahead and continue setup. Once redirection has been set up, you can go ahead and click finished. And on the redirect page, you'll notice here that I do not have any um, redirection set up yet. So let's go ahead and set up our first redirection. We are going to redirect traffic from our sample page to our about page. So to do that in the source URL, we will enter our sample page URL. Next, we want to add the target URL. This is where you're directing traffic to. So in this example, we are going to be directing traffic to our about page. Okay, so we'll copy our about page the target URL. Next, you can go ahead and click add redirect. Once you click on add redirect, your redirection will appear under the list. So we have one listed here and we can check that to make sure that it's working. So I like to click on that. If you just hover over the link, you can see it pops up edit, delete, disable and check redirect. Click on check redirect and we'll get a green check mark. This means everything is good to go. If you get a red X, that means it's not working. So you need to go back and make sure that uh, your URLs are spelled correctly or if there's any other errors you need to be made aware of. I'd like to do one more check in real life. So if we open up our sample page, if I just go ahead and um, refresh our page, our sample page should redirect to our about page and it did. I hope you found this video useful to help you redirect your old WordPress pages and posts to new ones. If you have any questions, leave me a comment below. Be sure to subscribe to my channel and bye for now. Hey guys, my name is Jennifer Franklin and I wanna welcome you to my YouTube channel. Each week, I'll bring you a brand new video, so be sure to hit that subscribe button and leave me a comment below. See you later.